Hello, I am Michael Stevens from the YouTube channel Vsauce One, and you are watching the AU Review. Thank you very much for joining us. You just came off the stage. Your ears might be ringing. <laughs> Hopefully, because I told them to make them ring. I should talk to you. Tell us, uh, tell us a little bit about, uh, about what, what you've been up to here at the YouTube FanFest in Singapore. Here in Singapore, YouTube FanFest is letting me get on stage and do some experiments with the audience. I've got a decibel meter to measure how loud they are, and I've also got a, uh, um, a temperature reader that uses a laser dot so I can figure out which of the hosts can, can use friction to make their hands the hottest. Mm. Yeah. How did you get lit in the country with that laser gun? I still don't know. <laughs> I had it in my checked luggage, and when I got to the hotel, I opened my bag up, and it was right there. A, a gun that shoots a laser, Sydney. <laughs> well, let's talk about FanFest Sydney. You're about to head down to Australia for the first time. Are you looking forward to getting down there? You know, tell, us, tell us what you're, what, what you're hoping to get up to. I'm really excited to be in Sydney because the week before FanFest, I'm collaborating with creators from Australia. Mm. And I've never been to Australia before. It's going to be my first time. But Australians watch a lot of Vsauce. So it's about time I went there and talked to them. I'm going to especially be collaborating with Derek from a channel called Veritasium. Mm -hmm. And this guy's brilliant. He's way uh, smarter than I am, and he's better at demonstrations. So we're going to do some really cool stuff. And this might change, but we're going to be doing companion videos about randomness. There you go. So you're going to film that while you're in Australia? Yeah. And fans love it when two channels collaborate mm. because they get to see that it's all a big family, right? Mm. And they get to see their favorite YouTubers together. And uh, a lot of, you know, each of our channels have audiences, uh, subscribers that don't know about the other. And so we mm. can kind of grow together a lot faster by working together. And that's what FanFest is all about. Exactly. So are there any YouTubers that you'd love to collaborate with one day that, you know, maybe you haven't flown to the country that they live in to make, make that happen? It's hard to have a specific request. I want to get back into the Middle East and Africa. Mm -hmm. I think there's some really cool people out there. Um, if I collaborated with everyone I wanted to, I would never be home. <laughs> so you just find other ways to work, you know? You start yeah. working, hey, why don't we Skype or why don't we use a Google Plus Hangout? representing YouTube there. Uh, and, uh, you know, why don't you just compose music for what I'm about to do and send me the files? And there's all kinds of ways to work worldwide, so there's really no limit. What do you think is the kind of future of it in terms of, in terms of the, the, way, the way YouTube's heading with the kind of possibilities and the growing technology and, and all that? The possibilities are obviously not literally infinite because there are only, you know, so many, um, there's only so much energy in the universe, but YouTube is huge. The number of genres and people and types of talent and types of audiences that you can build there are essentially limitless. Mm. And I think that we're going to see um, what, what is happening already. It's just audiences aren't, they don't care what platform they're on, whether it's television or YouTube or something else. Uh, it's all just great content to them. And that's mm. what wins, that's what's successful, and that's what they really become fans of. Australia. You're coming to the for the first time. What do you know about Australia? What are some of the fun facts that you're trying to, you know, um, <laughs> research and learn about before you uh, before you come down? I'm really nervous because I still don't understand why people in Australia don't just fall off the earth. Just kidding. That's like the dumbest joke ever. <laughs> um, I really, really wish that I'd left a piece of bread laying on the ground in Spain before I left Europe because I'm also headed to New Zealand after this, and I believe Madrid and Auckland are almost anapodal. They're almost exactly opposite one another. So if you put pieces of bread on both those locations, you make an earth sandwich, literally. I didn't do that though, but I'm excited to be um, in Australia. I'm excited to see fans there and the, the creators who work there because they're brilliant. Mm. And I'm usually so far away. So obviously, huge shout out to all of the Australian Vsaucers out there. You guys are clearly amazing. Uh, if you don't know what I do yet, uh, you know, why don't you check out youtube.com slash Vsauce. It's kind of fun. We've also got Vsauce 2 and Vsauce 3, so there's a lot to watch. Have fun, and thanks for watching.